We will now create a drawing of the bearing bracket, but first I will come down here to um, select default for the configuration, and then I come here to select the flywheel position of the camera. So I will select the, the bearing bracket by control left click and then right click and here we can create a bulk drawing from part so I will select it and um, I will also change the default template for the drawing so I click this button and this dialog window opens and I come down here to check or select 250 by 250 no bum it says uh, that means no bill materials. So I select it, click OK, and make sure that this one is checked. Include externally linked parts assemblies in the main drawing, so it will uh, be a bulk drawing. And also use main scene to create first sheet in new drawing, and this is the main scene that we have here in the background. So I will click OK, and the drawing is created. Like so. If we come down here we see that we have two tabs. This part drawing and also the assembly drawing. I will update the drawing like so. But I would like to add more parts to this bulk drawing. So I will go back to the scene and here I press I, top front right and D for fit scene. I would like to add these connecting rods to the bulk drawing. So I Control left click the first one here, then I come over here to the properties here. If there is a box here, include in bulk drawing creation. Make sure that that one is checked, otherwise it will not be included. Then we have to select a drawing template. I click this button, drop down menu, and I have several uh, templates here already. And that's because I have done this before. But I will show you how you can add a template. You click Add IronCAD template here. And this dialog window opens. And this um, connecting rod is very small, so we can use the first one here. 100 by 100, no bill materials. Select it. Then you have to come back here to select it again here in this uh, template list. 100 by 100. So now it is confirmed that it will use that template for this drawing. Then I control left click the next one and I have to do the same procedure. Come down here, add IronCAD template. And this time I will choose uh, this 250 by 250, no bill materials. Select it, click OK. Make sure that it will be included in bulk drawing creation. And then you have to select it here, 250 by 250. Then control left click the next one, uh, check this box. Now we can use the same uh, template here, 250. And then control left click the last one, include in bulk drawing. And here I will choose 100 by 100, like so. So now each connecting rod has its own template. Then I come up here to click Bulk Drawing Creation. If we now go down here, uh, we see that we have our four connecting rods and there they have their templates. And make sure that this one is uh, checked now. So it will be a bulk drawing. Click OK. And the drawings are created. And if we come down here, we see that we have a bunch of drawings. And of course, you have to do some adjustments. Uh, for instance, this one, the scale is um, it's not right. I think we have to change that to one to one. And of course, you have to add dimensions so that they will be fully dimensioned. You can also change the name. For instance, this one, you can right click, go to rename. And here you can type uh, Sterling Engine and also the drawing number 200. And you can also you can do the same with the others if you want to. But you can 
do some adjustments to these uh, bulk drawings by uh, adding more dimensions so that they will be fully dimensioned. So this is how you can create uh, bulk drawings.